Yo, 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 it's Overflow. What's going on, you guys? How are you guys doing today? Bringing you another Call of Duty video. I hope that you definitely enjoy this one. We have a lot of stuff to talk about. There's a lot of stuff happening in the new games coming out, Infinite Warfare and COD 4 Remastered. There's stuff happening in Black Ops 3, stuff happening throughout the Call of Duty universe. And instead of bringing you guys, like, 15 different videos and just spamming you. I decided to do one video because I prefer to do that. If you guys enjoy the content or you support me, please drop a like on it. If we could shoot for a thousand likes on this video, that would be absolutely amazing. We haven't hit a thousand likes in like at least three days. So I don't know if you guys like just hate me or maybe you got school. There's lots of homework. I don't know what's happening, but I'm hurt. I'm hurt. If you're doing your homework instead of watching YouTube videos, what are you doing? Get your priorities in order. Totally kidding. Do your homework. Oh my gosh. But also watch my videos. You know, you know what I'm saying? Lots of stuff happening in the Call of Duty world. So let's go ahead and cover it. The first thing I want to talk about is the fact that Conor McGregor, the UFC fighter, MMA star, if you guys watch the UFC or anything like that, he is very, I'd say he's probably top three most popular UFC fighters as of right now. He is playing the villain in the upcoming Call of Duty game, Infinite Warfare, which is very, very cool. I think that's awesome in my opinion. He'll be the right-hand man, it appears, of the main villain, which is Jon Snow, of course, from Game of Thrones. So that's awesome. If you guys want to, you're more than welcome to check out all the sources in the description below. I do include, like, all the links of everything that I'm talking about, so you can actually go over to Conor McGregor's little Mac Life YouTube page and you could be like oh yeah there's a video there of him like actually at the Call of Duty headquarters you could go over there check that out and say hey overflow send me maybe he'll send me like some tickets and then I'll split them with you and we could go watch his next like UFC fight or something you know front row seats cool that would be awesome yeah drop a like and Conor McGregor will send you a UFC ticket. I'm pretty sure that's just what I heard. You know, I'm not really entirely positive, but that's the rumor. But either way, I think it's really cool that Conor McGregor is in the uh, storyline of Infinite Warfare. That's a really cool thing for me, because if you guys don't know, I actually have been training for a very long time. I've done a ton of mar martial arts and stuff, and actually, right after I get done with this video, I'm actually going to take my instructor uh, test for Jiu-Jitsu, which is pretty cool. So I think that I'm going to vlog that, actually. Let me know if you guys want to vlog of me like training i think that i'm gonna do a vlog for uh for tomorrow or something i think that it would be awesome so let me know about that but either way very cool to see ufc stars kind of cross over into the mainstream um which is awesome in my opinion the next thing i want to talk about is modern warfare remastered and the reason i want to talk about it is very very important to me it's because a lot of the complaints that we were seeing from people were because of the fact that the whole cod 4 remastered thing was striking a nerve with hardcore fans that have been playing for the longest saying stuff like oh man hey the headshots aren't correct i want the headshots to be different or they're saying that the sounds were a little bit off and that's one thing that i will be honest with you guys i did notice it i just covered it in a video 10 things that you might hate about modern warfare remastered if you guys haven't seen that video click on my page go watch it but I just covered some of these, and they actually addressed it, which is very, very cool. As you can see here, he's the guy who runs Raven or something. I don't know. Seems like a great guy, though. Great profile picture. Really strong jaw. I like that. Hashtag no chin. Raven has updated the sounds for the Barrett, the Deagle, the RPD, and M40 to more closely match the original hashtag MW Remastered. That's awesome in my opinion. They're trying to make it more true to the original. And I will say that the sounds were a little bit lacking when I played. Like when you shot the Deagle back in COD 4, like you heard that thing. Like you knew exactly what was happening. It was like, oh man, there's a Deagle. Watch out. But in the new Modern Warfare Remastered, you didn't get that same vibe. So I'm very happy that they are updating it. And make sure you guys follow me on Twitter because I do tweet about all this stuff. I'm very, very active on Twitter. I'm on Twitter all day long. So make Make sure you follow me it's gonna be one of the top links down below um so yeah i think that that's i think that's important but either way the next thing about the n other call of duty that's coming out this year of course infinite warfare i think we're all more pumped for the remastered cod 4 personally but it's pretty cool they just included a new pre-order bonus for infinite warfare you can get the bullet hawk personalization pack which comes with like calling cards reticles a camo and everything just for pre-ordering the game the camo doesn't look like it's the coolest thing in the world but it is animated from what i understand so i don't know exactly how it's gonna change or whatever but either way this is another pre-order bonus which is always welcome in my opinion give me all the bonuses i want the zombies map i want terminal and if you guys didn't know you're gonna get space on zombies 
terminal, I think some like random posters and stuff, and then of course the Bullet Hawk personalization pack if you do pre-order the game. I would personally recommend it, that's what I did. I think I have a few pre-ordered, and I definitely want to give some out to you guys too, so let me know. I want to I want to give away like 10 to 30 copies of, in, of Infinite Warfare and Modern Warfare Remastered for you guys. Um, yeah, and also, in addition to doing that, I also have like a link that's down there. It should say like free map packs or whatever. You can actually uh, click that link and then download some apps and earn free map packs, free COD points. If you want to put the money towards the new game, you could do that, which is very cool. So check out that link down below. It's going to say free whatever, something down there. So make sure you guys definitely check that out. I'm so tired. I have not slept. I have been so anxious for today because I'm going to go test to get my like little instructor certification belt thingy happening in jujitsu. I'll explain more in the vlog, but like I w was so excited that I have not slept all night. I feel I feel a little bit crazy, a little bit loopy, a little bit fruit loopy. Why do I go on random rants? Nobody even cares about this. Over it. What do you shut up? We're, we're listening to Call of Duty videos. I'm very sorry. I'm, I'm sipping some G Fuel. You know what I'm saying? Code flow. Use that. That would be beautiful. Makes it cheaper. Control Freaks, G Fuel, all that good stuff. And uh, <laughs> the last thing I want to cover is the fact that there's been so much dark matter camo talk the past, like, week in Black Ops 3. People are saying, oh, man, there's going to be this thing where you can get new dark matter camo colors. You can get blue, red, green, purple. Purple's already the main one. Purple's beautiful. And you can get all these colors. And uh, actually... It came out that it was Photoshop pictures and stuff, but we have seen gameplay. And my friend Hollow Point, I'll include his video down below as well, actually just went over some uh, blue Dark Matter gameplay, which is pretty cool. So just ignore his beautiful face, even though it's there and you're distracted. I want you to look at the gun. Stop looking at his face. Stop it. Very handsome man, I know. But look at the gun. It's blue Dark Matter. And the reason for that is hacks, bro. People are hacking the game. I believe it's on PC where they're getting into it and they're making the Dark Matter whatever color they want, which is very, very cool. But you'll notice that during certain specialist animations, the gun changes back to purple, which uh, is kind of an indication that this is hacks, bro. But I do want to say this. It'd be pretty cool, man. If they included some random Dark Matter camos that were like other colors, that'd be awesome in my opinion. Um, but yeah, as of right now, if you see anything about Dark Matter camos being different colors, it's literally just hacks. So I just kind of felt like doing that PSA, public service announcement, you know what I'm saying? And, um... Yeah, man, that's it for the video today. I am totally going to get ready and go get beat up by these people and uh, get my new uh, my new instructor thing here. If you guys don't know, real quick breakdown, uh, Jiu-Jitsu, Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu, what I do, right? It goes white, blue, purple, which is the first level of instructor, and then brown, black, right? That's how the belts go, and what, the higher up you get, the better you are, right? I'm getting my purple one today, which is overdue. I should have gotten it like a couple years ago, but like... Injuries and stuff kept me away from the testing, kept me away from training. So it feels good to actually be getting it. So I'm going to go do that right now. And then I'm going to come back here and I'm going to sleep for a very long time. And uh, you'll have a vlog, though, about it, I think, if you guys want. Tomorrow is a Pokemon Go vlog. And, um, yeah, I think I'm going to do some some cut comms uh, during this week, too. I think that sounds fun. But, yeah, that's that's the plan, I guess. And I just, I just felt like talking to you guys. You know, I really love you. Y'all are absolutely beautiful. And I will see you in the next one. Subscribe if you're new. Drop a like. If you made it this far in the video, go ahead and just say, Overt, you're so random. Just say something like that. Something that lets everybody know that I do not stay on topic whatsoever. I love y'all, and I will see you in the next one. I am Overt, and no.